Mr. Peterson here giving the good word at uh, the Lions Den Fighting Spear Wrestling 2016. And this will be one for the books, ladies and gentlemen. We have a wonderful night here. Auction Park Wrestling, as only Fighting Spear Wrestling can bring to you. Mr. Peterson getting the crowd uh, quite into it here. That's the music of Suntan, ladies and gentlemen, here he is, Superman Suntan, entering the ring here, one of the most beloved men in fighting spear wrestling, makes his way to the ring here, ladies and gentlemen, here he is, Suntan. And the crowd uh, reacting, of course, favorably to Mr. Suntan, as is always the case here at fighting spear wrestling. Suntan in the center of the ring there, waiting for his opponent to come into the ring. And the crowd's uh, waiting to see what's going to go on here. Mr. Suntan has the microphone, ladies and gentlemen. I had a feeling that would be the case here. <laughs> now, I, I was quite uh, flummoxed when I saw Mr. Suntan's uh, Facebook today. Ladies and gentlemen. Now, they call themselves the snot, they think they're cute. Run by this little uh, popsicle thing, Chris Rex. <laughs> you know, I don't think they're cute, they want to be like a thing where, I don't know what the hell, I'm talking about. I wasn't satisfied, I didn't give you guys the bench I wanted to give you. So, right about now, I hear my call out the snot. Mr. Suntan calling out the snot here, ladies and gentlemen, and there's the music we've uh, all become quite accustomed to there. Snot. Chris Rex Osriel, Mr. Sammy Callahan, and uh, perhaps a new member, as it were. Hearing some rumors about possibly about someone uh, entering there. And here's Chris Rex coming out there. Banner is being waved uh, proudly here, ladies and gentlemen. The snot comes out, enters the ring now. Suntan obviously not happy about the way things went down last time, and perhaps he'll make it uh, better. Strong words here from Mr. Chris Rex. They're not going to fight the official snap flag boy. Hey, the official flag boy. Flag boy there. And the crowd will let him have it here, ladies and gentlemen. The flag boy. Introducing Mario Wait a minute here, ladies and gentlemen. 
gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, here is the newest member of Snot, as it were. Coming out here into the ring, Mr. Bokara. Mr. Mario Bokara. Is he the new member of Snot that we've been hearing about here? And his unbelievable turn of events there. Coming out into the ring there, draped in a flag. I can't see what part of the flag is. Could be an Italian flag, could be a Mexican flag. Oh, I'm quite not sure here. I don't, oh, actually, now my eyes are going on me. I don't know which one of the flag it is there. And we're being joined here with the wonderful uh, ring announcer, Mr. Ryan Peterson, as it were. Well, first... Well, first off, it's good, it's good to be here at commentary. It's good to be here at commentary. Finally, here at Fighting Spirit Wrestling. Oh. Second of all, what a shocker we have here! Absolutely, uh, Snot uh, increasing its roster as it were here. And uh, Suntan with his joke. Uh, I quite knew that was a joke, and I saw it this morning on Facebook. Uh, but now there will be no jokes in the ring as Snot will take on his competitor, Mr. Peterson. You are quite uh, familiar with this gentleman. Uh, maybe a few words from you. In oh yes. Yeah. Well, for those of you who don't know, this gentleman's name is Mario Bocca, the Croatian sensation. And he is very well known up and down the East Coast. Currently a huge superstar at a promotion called WrestlePro. And I'm telling you, this guy has been blowing up everywhere. Now he's the newest member of the snod. This is like the biggest surprise I've, I've ever seen in an FSW ring, in my opinion. Absolutely. Uh, quite the tables are turning. And that was Mr. Roy and Peterson uh, who gave us a uh, little bit of insight on this gentleman. Uh, and here is Ozzy giving a proper check to Suntan there. Make sure uh, no foreign objects. Like beer cans or anything in there? Beer cans, uh, brass knuckles, anything there. But I don't know that it's uh, sometimes the type to carry those types of uh, those types of arms with him into the ring. The gentleman in the ring being associated with Snot, I cannot say the same for him. Boy, these FSW fans are really giving it to Bokara. Absolutely. Uh, Mr. Bokara, Bokara as it were, getting ready to square off here with Mr. Suntan and apparently uh, oh there it is ladies and gentlemen uh, Mr. Suntan caught by surprise there a hot start by Mario Bolkar to kick, off, kick things off here at the Lions Den absolutely uh, blindsided there Mr. Suntan uh, soaking in the sun of love from the fans there but uh, he's paying for it now as this gentleman is uh, working him uh, up against the ropes there absolutely Bloody thrashing him to the back there. Trying to work Suntan in the corner. Suntan obviously with the size advantage here, Mr. Peterson. Oh, what a chop to the chest by Bolkara. Uh-oh. Suntan's not happy now. Suntan. Oh, my God. A massive chop to the chest there. Bloody thrashed him. The tables have turned here, ladies and gentlemen. Aye, aye, aye. Again, uh, Mr. Suntan inserting, uh, exerting the pain, as it were. I would hate to be chopped by Suntan here. And he looks like he's trying to give him a chop in all four corners, ladies and gentlemen. Absolutely. Uh, word, of, word of advice, if you ever want a conversation with Suntan, just walk away. Absolutely, Mr. Suntan, quite a formidable character in the ring. And there it is. Chopped him properly at the fourth ring post there. Ozzy giving the count there. As, uh, Mr. Suntan with his hands on the neck there. And that's illegal, but uh, all's, well, all's well as ends well, as, as we say there. I'm still trying to figure out why the Snot has a flag boy. I'm like, what really? Why? Why do they have a flag boy? Why? Absolutely. Uh, the flag boy there, waving the flag of Snot. The Scumbag Nation of Truth, or whatever it is. Uh, I can think sure. of 10 things off the top of my head that these fans want to do with that flag. Uh, absolutely. And uh, most of them, Mr. Peterson, we cannot share here. But uh, we'll let the fans at home and the fans here use their imagination, as it were. Absolutely. See the technical uh, ability on display here as Suntan. Eh? Oh! Quite the show of what a here. suplex by Mario Bocca. Absolutely. Eh? And you know, he's very well known for his suplexes. Eh? Perfectly executed. He is very well known. And oh, Mr. Oh. Suntan now in the corner. Oh, now Suntan's rolled out of the ring now. And uh, Mr. Uh, Steranko uh, has just joined us, as it were. Hey, welcome to the commentary, right. brother. I'll see him. He'll be meeting us in a minute. There. Late. That's all right. 
We forgive you. Uh-oh. What is Suntan doing here? What's he doing to Mario? That's oh, my God, Suntan. Don't. No, please don't. Suntan. Uh, with oh. The oh. Mario bloody blasted Suntan against the ring post there. Mr. Suntan will feel that, ladies and gentlemen, in the morning. Thank God I'm just a ring announcer. Oh, my goodness. Absolutely, and that was quite painful. Here's Mario outside the ring, and he'll try to work on Suntan again in the corner there. Lovely thrashing him with kicks in the face, as it were. Do my eyes deceive me? Do I see another member of Snot? Absolutely. Yes, we do. Uh, Mr. Serenko on a conference call with Donald Trump, as it were, today. The reason for the lateness. But now, <laughs> we have this gentleman in the ring, uh, Mr. Mario Bocher, a Croatian uh, gentleman. And uh, he's bloody thrashing for Suntan at this point in the match. It is a good day for Snot, my friends. And the future is great for that faction. And like, and like I said earlier, I'm, I'm very surprised that, you know, the Snot recruited Mario Boker, a, a very well-known. He's wrestled all across the all across the East Coast and actually had a recent stint with Reality of Wrestling down in Houston, with, which is owned by none of the, the five-time WCW champion, Booker T. And he's very well down there as well. Well, why are you surprised, Ryan? Snot is a very stand-up organization. Of course they can get someone of his caliber. Oh, I mean, yes, they got Tim Callahan in the first place, but I would never expect they got Mario Volker. Uh-oh, looks like Volker has got, got something where he needs it to be. Well, in this match, uh, ladies and gentlemen, it's been a bit one-sided, as it were. From the very beginning, when uh, Mr. Suntan was blindsided by Mr. Volker, is uh, thrashing in the corner, and uh, the Snot roster, to the delight of Mr. Steranko is increasing with uh, Sami Callahan, this gentleman in the ring, Chris Rex, Osriel, and now the flog boy who's waving the flag of snot to the dismay here of all the fans of Fighting Spirit Wrestling. That's right. And this is the future of snot. Oh, look at this. They're getting bigger names and they're taking down names like Suntan. I looked at it. Mario Booker wasn't a wrestler. He became a very well-known chiropractor or just standing in people's backs just trying to break him or whatnot. I'm just saying. Hey, he could probably fix my back in a heartbeat. That's a good point, uh, <laughs> Mr. Peterson, as he's bloody working on him here. Mr. Suntan clearly in trouble. There's Mr. Booker with the, a pin there, near full, just a two count, but you can tell Suntan in trouble here, ladies and gentlemen. As the fans here in Brooklyn trying to get behind Suntan, Mario still has him down. I think he has him in a sleeper hole now. I, uh, during that pin, if you saw, Mario's leg accidentally was on the rope. Yeah, but referee did not see it, so. Well, you know how it is that uh, uh, referee is not seeing it, uh, it's as if it never happened. Uh, we've seen many contests uh, decided with the referee looking the other way. Uh, it is what it is, as they say in the States here. Right now, Mario is choking the life out of Suntan. Absolutely. Uh, what a uh, sleeper hell he got on him, but here's Suntan. Oh. Looks like he's trying to make a comeback here. Uh, body shots there by Suntan, but then a knee to the chest by Mr. Bakara. Uh, as per usual, Suntan is out here alone. And he's going up against oh. the entire organization of Snot. Eventually, numbers game is going to count. And it got to be a tough thing to do when you're up against Snot because you're never really up against one opponent in a contest in the squared circle. You've got all these people around discouraging you, talking uh, nastiness to you, trying to disrupt you. Oh! I don't think it's oh, nastiness. Oh, 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 oh my goodness! Look at that. executed suplex. Inside and outside the ring, Snot is impressive. Wow. And how Mr. Suntan was not pinned with the three count there is beyond me. Perfectly executed uh, suplex there on Suntan. And for most of this march, it's been all Mr. Bakara. Probably attribute that to a slow count from the ref, in my opinion. Yeah, perhaps you're right, Mr. Stranko. Of course I'm right, I'm always right. Yeah, yeah, that's what they all say. Yeah, come off it, Mr. Stranko. Uh, that's right, they all do say that, I am right. Here he is. Oh, nice reversal by Sunday. Very nice. Showing the oh, technical oh, ability look here. At look at this! Oh! Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. That was destructive from Suntan. The technical ability on display here. For a guy that size, ladies and gentlemen. And a kick out at two. And another near fall. Suntan not able to close the deal here. 
the resilience of Mario. He's got the power of Snap behind him now, so he's not going to let himself get pinned that easily. What the heck is he doing? Now, what's going on here? He has a lot to prove tonight for the rest of his Snap brethren. Uh oh. Listen, Tan. Drop a body slam there. Let me cross him to the canvas. Is he the one I think he's going to do next? And, gentlemen, oh, we've seen this before. Oh boy. I don't like where this is going. We've seen Mr. Sun Tan do that. The crowd is chanting it. Mossad Men's Hopefully, get it. On the there you go. Oh, no. And he's on the second. Oh. Not the top rope. Oh God! All the plans for Mr. Sunshine. Oh. Unbelievable! Wow. Perfectly executed. We're there. just lucky that ring stayed standing. Absolutely, Suntan was bloody thrashed, but only a two count. A Barely count. kicked out of that. The match looks like it changed hands, uh, changed wins for a moment there, but Suntan again in trouble here. Well, you got all these fooligan fans out here chanting, chanting moonsault. What it did, it tipped Mario off. Well, absolutely, I have to say, uh, I will agree with you, uh, but Mr. Mario is in no position to know oh! what is going on now. I think that was a spine buster, I think that was. Oh, absolutely, perfectly executed spine buster there. I, would I say thought that all the way over here. That was, that was a spine disintegrator, in my opinion. But only a two count there, as Mr. Suntan having a, uh, trouble here with, uh, with this gentleman in the ring, the newest member of Snot here, ladies and gentlemen. And Chris Rex uh, running the mouth, talking uh, nonsense, as it were, to every one of the people in the crowd here, talking uh, now nonsense to like we're, going a, we're going for another moonsault. You call it running the mouth, I call it running the situation. Chris right. Rex is a general, and he's acting as such. Right. Mr. Uh, Mr. Rex, absolutely. Uh, here's Mr. Rex. Here's there. Uh, there you go, boys. boys. Got him working on Suntan here. Oh, look at the stuff just came in. There you I go, boys. Give him the business. So yeah, lost one to a disqualification. Big deal. This is fantastic. Unbelievable. And a bloody thrash and suntan in the center of the ring there with that slut flag. And this is absolutely Wait disgusting here. Wait a second. Uh, ladies and that, gentlemen. That magma the Japanese killing machine magma taking things into his own hand here. Strange bedfellows indeed here, coming to the rescue of Mr. Suntan. That's just disappointing for Magma to me. Yeah, absolutely. But uh, got another thing happened here. Mr. Suntan bloody thrashed outside the ring there. The bell is rung, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, and we have a brawl here going on with Osriel and the Japanese killing machine Magma, which I believe was supposed to be a proper match here. Yeah, it just started out of nowhere. And Mr. Peterson, this was, uh, am I wrong, this was a, a match on the card here. Oh, absolutely. And then, uh, a very hot start here from Magma. Oh, oh, what a kick to the face. Bell is wrong. We're going right into this match. Absolutely here. The bell no, is wrong. No, we're for this one. What's going on, Ryan? He wanted to fight. I assume it took you a while to get in there. So you're like, now let him go. Absolutely. Wasting no time is Magma, who has cleared the ring of all the members of Snot here. And here's a suicide oh! dive. Unbelievable! You know, he might have changed his attitude, but his crazy, crazy, crazy ways oh are the God. same. Ladies and gentlemen, Chris Rex is feeling that pain there. As Magma, with the super lightning quick suicide dive, bloody thrashed him against the guardrail there. And I'm surprised that Flag Boy is oh. uh, not counting his teeth here. Well, there you go. Now Magma's paying for his big gamble outside the ring. Uh, Magma knows the, ring, the kind of misdirection that uh, employed by Snot and uh, taking things into his own hands here. And Oswald thrashing him into the corner there. Asriel is world class. Oswald with the submission move here. He's going to send Magma back to Japan or wherever he crawled out from under. I'm telling you this right now, what a good way to start it off the Lions then. And if this, if this continues, oh boy, the main event tonight will be ecstatic. Uh, we have all types of implications tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Absolutely. Uh, Surprisingly, I agree with you, sir. Lots of things going on here. Lots of things going on. We have uh, this.
feud between uh, Mr. Maximo and Mr. Werner. We have uh, Magma putting it all out there with Mr. Osriel. We have the newest member of Snot. Uh, we have Tolland vs. somebody for the Pyro Championship. We have an auction packed evening here tonight here in, in beautiful Brooklyn on a beautiful night. That was a beautiful slingshot dive from Asriel. Osriel again here putting the pressure on with the proper leverage as it were onto Magma. Magma not an easy guy to make submit as the uh, cheerleaders of Snot are outside the ring. Did you say cheerleaders? Absolutely. Are you call them cheerleaders? They have a gentleman with the flag if you'd call them such. Uh, I don't see skirts. Well, I don't see women outside the ring. What are you talking about? Those are a group of men. Well, yeah, more, yeah, more of the spirit squad. Oh, there we go. Uh, and here we stand are. Stand up, people. Aye, Show aye, some aye. respect. Mr. Osriel waving the flag here, the flag of Snort, as it That's were. That's right. Wait, I may need that later. That's right. Long live Snot. Now, you yeah, yeah, yeah. running down the uh, car tonight, one thing about this Lion Den's Battle Royal, it's going to be action packed. Oh, absolutely. And my money is on Chris Rex this evening to become the next number one contender for the title. Oh, that, I would not uh, be putting my money on that, uh, on that Mr. Stranko. You should. I thought you were a betting man, Wesley. I am a betting man, but in a situation like a battle royal, where you might have to fight like you're inside of a phone booth at one point or another, it does not favor a man with Chris Rex's physique. It, it favors a man like Leon Mason, uh, perhaps a Mike Werner, uh, someone with oh. meat on his bones, as it were. Okay. First of all, that's disrespectful. Second of all, it's not about just praying. Chris Rex is in there with an army. The army of snot. And that's more than just one man. Absolutely, and uh, only missing Mr. Callahan here tonight. Oh, he's here in spirit. Unbelievable. Mr. Osriel having his and way here with Magma. And for once I agree with Mr. With, uh, Mr. Storick though about it, you know. Callahan being here in spirit. He is here in spirit, but unfortunately he's not here physically tonight, so it's not had to, you know, find someone to fill a gap. Absolutely. It's not, uh, don't really any, need anyone because, uh, as it were, it's not always uh, around the ring. If it's one of their guys, they do stick together, whether it's five or 15 of them, and uh, it seems like every uh, every event we have, they are a new member to Snot. Woo! Lovely. Speaking of sticking together, Suntan didn't stick around to help out his friend Magma. Uh, I don't know that I would call them friends there, but uh, oh. they have been strange bedfellows in the past there. Working against a common enemy, which is Snot. Uh, actually an enemy of everyone here at Fighting Spirit Wrestling, it's, as it were. It's a clear distinction of what happens when a man has a crew behind him. When there's loyalty behind that man. Magma, Suntan, no loyalty. Yeah. Mr. Magma. No. Oh! Going out it in the center of the ring here. The with Osriel. Oh! Putting blast him with a phase line from behind and puts wow. him on the canvas. Get pack it up, friends. This match is about to be over. Once Azrael gets back on his feet, there he's gonna go. end it. Uh, referee Ozzy here counting. Up to the five counts here. Well, one of these gentlemen. And we can't stop there. A little kick there by uh, Magma. Another oh. kick to the face there. Wow. And Magma showing that Japanese street fighting ability there. Oh! Magma is a very scary individual. Only a two count, ladies and gentlemen. A Only a two count. count on that one. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Start to lines then. We're, 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 we're treated here to two back to back brawls. This is what FSW is all about. Amen to that. Absolutely. Fighting oh, Spirit Wrestling. You bring you the best in hardcore wrestling uh, in the world, ladies and gentlemen. Osriel, nasty knee. Short the knees. Section there. Very nice. So short knees are making short work of magma. Uh, both of these guys. Oh! Fluffy blasted him in the face there. And magma will be feeling that, ladies and gentlemen. Oh! A kick out of two! Wow! What the hell is Magma made out of, huh? Sharing the resilience here, Mr. Oh, Serenko. He's not made out of blood, I'll tell you that. Now, Mr. Serenko, uh, 
I know you're fond of magma. Perhaps your uh, loyalties I, are shifting now. I was fat, fond of magma before he started coming out and helping out people like Suntan. Yeah. Yeah, magma seems to be on a, a man on his own team now. Well, you know what? His attitude may change, but that Senton doesn't. Now, this is quite some march here. And these fans are so fickle. A month ago, they were booing Magma. Oh, what an elbow to the face. So for no one. Oh! Magma hopping his way for here. Third one. Lucky thrash with the elbow there. Here's the, here's the pin. No way. A near fool there. Hard wow. to see what was going on there. But the misdirection by Mr. Chris Rex. Chris hey. Direction, as I call him. Just wreck the, uh, uh, yeah, misdirecting the referee here. That's a very negative term. Oh! And uh, Magma should not be uh, tending to what Chris Rex is saying. Oh, no. He should be well, 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 paying attention Angel. to what's going on in the ring here. And as he's going to the, going to the top rope now. Setting up for the... Oh! And double missile drop kick there. Perfectly executed. Ha! And it's over, ladies and gentlemen. As you said, Wesley. As you said, Wesley, wow. Chris Direction. It may sound a little offensive, but it's true and it's smart. Yeah, it works. It's absolutely. Uh... So right now, the snot are 2 0 this evening. Well, I think 2 0. I'm not sure what the first match. Let's see if they keep a streak going on here tonight at the Lions Den with the Lions Den Rumble later on this evening. That's absolutely. right. I predict. I predict a clean sweep by Snot. Absolutely. Let's say you go. guys to come in, uh, everything's going to be good to go. Okay.